Hey Maddie, it's your grandma's friend Jim. Welcome to my backyard. Uh, we have bees to put out this year, so I'm going to show you how we put them in the hive. It'll take a few minutes, um, but I hope you enjoy this. So, do you remember these boxes? These are boxes that hold the frames that the bees will put the honey in, make the honey in. So down below you can see there are 10 frames that the, uh, the bees will live in as they get the hive going. We're going to start by giving them some feed because they need something to eat right away. We have to give them some sugar water. So I have put together two parts sugar, one part water. In this container I've poked some little holes in the top. What I need to do is create some suction in this by pressing the top and bottom together to get as much air out as possible. You can do it this way. And then flip it over. And you can see the sort of bubble up there. That's good. Those sticks are under there so the bees can get underneath so they can get access to the um, to the to the syrup. Now we're gonna start getting the uh, the bees ready to put in. This is the box they come in. It's a three pound box of bees. I think there are about 3,000 bees in this box. So what we're gonna do is get the, uh, the queen out first and get her in there so she's uh, nice and comfortable and ready to take on the rest of the bees. I'm gonna do that by removing this can that's on top of the uh, bees. This is done. There you see? That's the syrup that came with the bees. There's little holes in the bottom. The bees sure like that syrup. Now the queen comes in her own little cage. So Oh, the bees are starting to fly. That's good. Okay. See this little cage? This is the cage that the queen is in. She's the only queen with all these other bees. Get these off so you can see in there. What we want to do is we want to make it safe for her to come out. So. We need a marshmallow. What we do is this. We take this little cork on the end and we pop it out. Get off there, fella. He likes his queen. We take this cork out. And then we put this marshmallow in the hole. What that does is keep the queen in her cage while we put the rest of the bees in. So we're just going to set this in here for now. The other bees and the queen will eat through that marshmallow and get her out. Now here's the fun part. This is the part where we put the bees in. So I'm going to open the box and shake them all into the into the container. Or into the hive rather. So watch this. So we're covering up the queen. Getting as many bees in here as we can get. Again, 
I think there are about 3,000. We don't have to get them all out because they will find their way back to the queen. So now we'll just set this aside and these bees will come out later. Now we'll just put some newspaper in there. We want the bees to settle down into the bottom of the hive. That's where they're going to live. Gently pack that in there. That kind of forces the bees into the bottom. And then we put on our covers. Can you hear them buzzing in there? Yeah, they're very active. I think we're going to have a great year. We put our covers on to protect the bees from the weather. And that's it. In one week, we'll come back. I'll take that top box off. I'll remove the syrup uh, container, get rid of all the paper and those two little sticks, and also the queen box, and then put the cover on just the lower box. And that's where the bees will get a start on their brood box. They'll start laying eggs and start bringing flowers or nectar in from flowers. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this, Maddie. I uh, look forward to talking to you soon. Bye-bye.